This is how to install um, KDE Connect, and I'm doing it in Linux Mint Cinnamon. This assumes that you already have the KDE Desktop installed. So we're going to update apt. We're going to do sudo apt install KDE connect. Yes. <clears throat> had a little trouble installing this because what I was following online didn't tell me I had to install KDE first. So now we're going to install indicator dash KDE connect from GitHub. <clears throat> I'm going to do sudo apt install python3 dash requests dash oauth lib We're going to do dpackage i and the name of our indicator KDE Connect file. This program will allow you to transfer files. Um, photos, videos directly from your phone to your PC. And you can also receive and answer texts from your desktop.
I'm going to start indicator here. It's installed. Now I'm going to install KDE Connect on my phone from the Play Store. There it is. Starting it up, there's my computer. So the request pairing. Um, after that I had a pop-up on my desktop asking me to accept this pairing and I said OK. Click Send Files. <clears throat> I'm going to go down to Screenshots. And I clicked on that first photo. You can see the up arrow in the upper left corner there that showed the transfer took place. Now I've got that uh, plugins failed to sync, so we'll click that, open settings, turn on notification access for KDE Connect, and we'll see that the error is gone. It allows phone notifications to show up on my desktop. Do send files again. Top picture, you see another up arrow in the top left corner there, indicating success. Now I'll go back to the host machine downloads folder. And there's my two folders, or two pictures. It's the same procedure to send a video. <coughs> and this is my host desktop after I installed KDE. And I've got those four programs there for KDE Connect. KDE Connect Monitor, it'll show my phone up there and how much battery life I have left. And it also showed two notifications that were on my phone. KD indicator settings. KDE connect settings. Now I'll click on my phone here, and we want to make sure we have share and receive checked. Now we can click on the KD indicator icon. Down at the bottom, we see uh, Browse Device. So with this, I can actually get into my phone and <clears throat> transfer files back and forth. So I transferred this from my phone, my video. Transferred another photo. More notifications from the phone.
You can use that button to ring your phone if you can't find it in your home. That's how I use KDE Connect to transfer videos and photos from my phone directly to my computer. Thanks, enjoy.